Board, we simply could not have someone more appropriate to present this as it's an application topic that's very near and dear to his heart. Please welcome Dr. James Truchard. Thank you. Isn't it incredible, all the papers and the applications? It's always very rewarding to see these. Uh, today we talked about uh, the National Academy of Engineering Grand Challenges and the things that engineers need to be doing to make this a better planet. And on the top of the list is green engineering applications. They are very serious problems. We don't even know the outcome of not solving these problems. That's really the toughest part of all. And so we have to, as engineers and scientists, be working very intently to solve these problems. Not every solution that we come up with will be the winner. They can win a paper contest, but they may not be the winner in terms of solving our uh, toughest challenges with global climate climate change and the like. So over the last few years, we've gotten more and more involved in these grand challenges for engineering, especially the ones around green with many, many different applications. Now I know that not every one of them will be successful, but I believe it's a true responsibility to try. So once again, we have a paper today uh, that is doing just that, trying. I passed Dave Wilson an article from Wall Street Journal commenting on the viability of this approach and whether it was going to be refunded and so forth. Uh, but it, as scientists and engineers, we have to look past that and really look at what the opportunities it is. Because so often I find that the actual application is one that was counterintuitive, that didn't look right like the right answer first. So our winner today used graphical system design, used products near and dear to my heart, graphical system design with LabVIEW, Compact Rio, and the 9205 drive module to create this application. Everybody laughs because they know who worried about that last tenth of a percent of efficiency of that module, uh, and they, they can vouch for it, right, uh, right uh, Robert? Uh, so uh, we, uh, so you can tell this was just for me really special. So our winner to, uh, tonight, and um, I had the fortune of Dave describing the application because there is no way I could describe it as eloquently as Dave did. So I'm glad he did that, so I couldn't possibly uh, meet the challenge. So I'd like to announce that the winner of the 2008 Green Engineering Application of the Year Award is Kurt Osborne from uh, Ford Motor Company for his paper titled, NI Tools Keep Ford at the Forefront of Innovation. Congratulations.